prepping for harder days. Now, I know a lot of you guys tune in here on a regular basis, and lately things seem to be slowing down just a little bit as if, kind of like the calm before the storm, you know what I mean? But I know most of us are just working day by day, just trying to get by. Now, I heard from one of you guys prepping with her elderly mom, and it just hurts my heart just to hear, you know, when she talks about seeing her mom fade. It's kind of hard to keep the faith going when you're alone, and I get it. So finding helpful people, contacts, friends when you're isolated and stuck is really something that we should be doing. It definitely helps to keep you going, honestly. So yeah, let's just take a pause and do a privilege check on that one, right? Let me know how you guys are doing right now in this economy and our current government. Just drop me a quick comment down below. Now, proper prepping also includes not being bored out of our minds while we're at home. Now, speaking of not being bored at home, are you guys ready to experience nonstop excitement without ever stepping out of the house? Then let me introduce you to the incredible world of DraftKings Casino. Now, I would like to thank DraftKings for sponsoring this video, and I'm super excited to share an amazing deal with you guys that you do not want to miss. So picture this, a completely online casino platform offering over 300 real money games. That's right, DraftKings Casino brings the thrill of the casino right to your fingertips. And guess what? They have an unbeatable offer for all new customers. So here's the deal. When you sign up using the promo code Ron Yates and make a minimum $5 deposit, DraftKings will match your deposit dollar for dollar up to a whopping $100 in casino credits. And so that means if you deposit $50, you'll have $100 in credits to play with. How incredible is that? With over 175 five slot games to choose from, including all of your favorites and exclusive titles only available at DraftKings, the possibilities for fun and big wins are endless. But wait, there's more. If casino gaming isn't yet available in your state, don't worry. DraftKings has got you covered with their daily fantasy app where you can compete for cash prizes throughout the season. Now, I know what you might be thinking. Is DraftKings safe, secure, and reliable? Absolutely. DraftKings has built a reputation as a trusted platform, ensuring your gaming experience is not only exciting, but also worry-free. So you can focus on what matters most, having an incredible time and a chance to win big. So don't miss out on this golden opportunity to join DraftKings Casino today. Sign up using promo code Ronye make a deposit of at least $5 and get your deposit matched dollar for dollar up to $100 in casino credits. It's time to elevate your gaming experience and let the good times roll. So visit DraftKings Casino online or download the DraftKings Casino app now and get ready for an unforgettable adventure. Get in on the action today and let the games begin. Now here in Georgia, I've noticed that whenever I head to the store, it's pretty well stocked. Now I wish I could stock up as much as I wanted, but hey, gotta stick to the budget, right? And while we're here scrimping and saving, you got Silicon Valley tech entrepreneurs buying up bunkers in New Zealand. <laughs> yeah, that's right, guys. Now, according to experts in the prepper movement, although the prepper movement in America spans the upper and middle classes, the left and the right Silicon Valley has in recent years become its epicenter. What do they know that we don't know? Now, we're going to take a look at what these billionaires are doing today. And hey, we don't have to spend millions of dollars just to prep for, you know, when stuff hits the fan, right? It's the season for planting gardens, tackling those outdoor projects, and in enjoying the better weather. So kudos to all you guys that are actually out there getting stuff done. Now, I think you guys can agree with me on this one. While it might seem like clear skies right now, we may have hit a lull just before the storm on the horizon, metaphorically speaking, of course. So today, I just want to have a little bit of chat with you guys and remind you about a few important things that we need to keep in mind. These are actions that you can take to stay prepared even when things are looking up. Now, before you tell me it's impossible to prep with a limited budget, I got you covered. Prepping on a budget is possible even if you don't have a lot of time and money. Like most projects, you can stretch your cash further and further with the right mindset and determination. So grab a cup of your favorite drink, find a comfy spot, and let's dive into some of the crucial reminders, all right? Because being ready for whatever comes our way is not just a mindset, it's a way of life. Now, my religious friend always quotes me this, the horse is prepared against the day of battle, but safety is of the Lord, end quote. Whatever you guys believe, know that I believe in you. So definitely stick around, and together we're going to navigate this unpredictable world. So shortages are dependent on the area in which you live. Now, some people, their gardens are doing very nicely where they are, and you may want to check out what you're local garden scene is like right now and see if you can get in contact with some preppers and producers in your area. And before you know, you could be a top producer yourself. Now it's time we get ready for when stuff hits the fan. Now if you're looking for a reason that the world will suddenly end, it's not hard to find one, especially if your job is to convince people that they need to buy things to prepare for the apocalypse. World War III, China, Russia, Iran, North Korea, Joe Biden, you know, 
everything that's messed up in the world. That is according to Ron Hubbard, the CEO of Atlas Survival Shelters. Now his Texas based company sells bunkers with bulletproof doors and concrete walls to people willing to shell out several thousands and up to millions of dollars for peace of mind about potential catastrophic events. According to him, quote, when the war broke out in Ukraine, my phone was ringing every 45 seconds for about two weeks, end quote. So yeah, there's a whole prepper economy here, maybe a financial opportunity to look into. I'm just saying. And hey, you never know, this could be the additional income stream that you might've been looking for, right? And if you talk to these guys, they're definitely going to be feeling like something big is about to drop. JC Cole, who runs a prepping business called American Heritage Farms, he outlined 13 gray swan events that he believes are both imminent and powerfully destructive. Now, he's pretty sure that the United States is going to go to war with Russia and China sometime in the next year. But wow, you know, like this is the first time that I've actually heard such a bold timeline. But what do you guys think? Now, at the same time, Cole and other prepper entrepreneurs are worried about hyperinflation, which is basically happening as we speak. Credit collapse, various natural disasters, electromagnetic pulses, EMPs, nuclear bombs, biological weapons, or solar storms destroying the electrical grid. And so that's why he's developing organic farms and underground shelters that can help save a handful of paying members. Now you can be sure, big tech is prepping their fannies off. <laughs> According to OpenAI CEO Sam Altman, he said, quote, guns, gold, potassium iodide, antibiotics, batteries, water, gas masks from the Israeli Defense Force, and a big patch of land in Big Sur that he can fly to. In the event of super contagious viruses, nuclear war, and AI that attacks us. Wow. So yeah, you can definitely try to start your own garden for starters. And when you hit the store, try to grab an extra item or two just in case, you know what I'm saying? After that, find people that you can connect with in your community. Building connections with like-minded souls not only expands your network, but it also introduces you to individuals who share your values and your mindset. It's kind of like finding a treasure trove of good-hearted people. And hey, not to mention the people that you help might just become some of your greatest allies and supporters. Talk about a win-win situation right there, right? And it's not just about networking or scoring brownie points. It's about finding purpose. You see, sometimes we get so caught up in our own little world thinking only about survival and brushing everybody else off. But that's not the way to go. We need to have compassion for all people, even the ones that might be a little bit too ignorant or unaware. Who knows, maybe by extending a little bit of a helping hand to somebody who doesn't quite get it yet, we can make them see the bigger picture and unite for a common purpose. So yeah, let's keep our hearts open and our actions kind. It's all about creating a positive ripple effect that spreads far and wide, keeping your friends and your loved ones safe no matter what. And really with everything that's happening in the country right now and in the world, it doesn't hurt to take the time for some self-reflection and soul searching. Whether it's praying, meditating, or just getting in contact with your inner self, it's all about finding that inner peace, you know what I mean? Don't wait for tough times to hit before you actually start investing in your spiritual side. Now, trust me, you know, that's a big mistake. Now, I've seen people go through these rough patches with an incredible sense of peace and comfort. And you know what? They were the ones who had a strong connection with their faith way before the storm arrived. Now, I'm talking about spirituality here, not necessarily religion, meaning your personal connection to something bigger than yourself. It's about finding meaning, purpose, and inner peace in life. You do your own thing, like meditating, being mindful, figuring out what you believe and what you value. It's like your own journey of self-discovery and growth. You could mix and match different ideas and sources of inspiration that resonate with you. It's like finding your own spiritual groove, right? Now, religion, on the other hand, that's a little bit more organized and community-based. It's a set of beliefs and rituals and rules that a group of people follow together. They got their own texts, ceremonies, and places of worship. It's like a big club with shared practices and values. Religions give you guidelines on how to live a good life and answer big questions about the meaning of everything. But here's the thing, spirituality and religion, they can overlap a little bit. Many religious folks have their own personal spiritual practices within their faith. And then you got those who are spiritual, but not religious. They kind of take bits and pieces from different traditions or make up their own unique spiritual path. So at the end of the day, spirituality is a little bit more personal kind of like your own journey of finding inner peace and meaning, if that makes sense. Then you got religion. It's a little bit more structured and community oriented with rules and rituals to follow. But hey, it's your call on how you want to explore and express your own personal beliefs. You just got to do what feels right for you. Now, as somebody who's seen a lot, I got to tell you, it really breaks my heart when I see people neglecting their spiritual preparedness. Now, sure, stockpiling food, securing your safety, both financially and whatnot. You know, there's no doubt about it. Super important. But 
you never want to really forget nurturing your spirit too. Really, whether the world goes crazy or not, we kind of all face our personal crises and eventually we'll all pass away. It's just the way of life. So you got to be ready to face those tough moments and keep your faith intact. Now, I won't go too deep into your personal beliefs or anything because, you know, that's your business and I respect that. But take a minute to think about, you know, where you stand in terms of your own faith. You know, basically sooner or later, we're all going to face some challenges and go through some rough patches. It could be a crazy disaster or just some internal struggle messing in your head. And in those moments, I'm telling you, your spiritual foundation will be your saving grace. But hey, enough about the heavy stuff. Let's not dwell on it for too long. Now, I hope you're enjoying life, tackling those to-do lists, building some passive income on the side, stacking up your emergency funds, and making some progress. But yeah, the storm clouds, they might be brewing on the horizon, but let's not lose ourselves to the doom and gloom, all right? Stay informed, but also take care of yourself. Find that little sweet spot between being in the know and keeping your sanity intact. So appreciate the good things in your life, cherish your relationships, and spend quality time with those who you love. And most importantly, do not forget to count your blessings and be grateful for what you have. All right, my friends, so go out there, have a great day, have a good mix of gratitude, love, and preparedness. You guys got this. Anyway, I hope you guys had a good time talking about all this preparedness prepping, you know, with a storm on the horizon. Now, I hope you guys had a blast hanging out with me. Make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more eye-opening updates and helpful conversations. And don't forget to drop a comment down below to share your thoughts and experiences. Also, don't miss out on this golden opportunity to join DraftKings Casino today. Go ahead and sign up using promo code Ron Yates. Make a deposit of at least $5 and get your deposit matched dollar for dollar up to $100 in casino credits. It's time to elevate your gaming experience and let the good times roll. So visit DraftKings Casino online or download the DraftKings Casino app now and get ready for an unforgettable adventure. So to my financial freedom fam, keep exploring, keep growing, and keep striving toward that financial freedom goal. Remember, life is about finding your own path and enjoying the ride. I'll see you guys on the next one. Be safe.